Okay, this tutorial, it's not actually a tutorial, it's a session on what's in my doc. I decided to do one of those. I've seen a couple others on YouTube, and uh, I decided to do mine. So of course we've got the good old finder, yeah, browse files. It's got to be there. Okay, then we've got mail. I constantly use mail. Um, I'm constantly checking my emails and uh, creating notes for myself in my iPod. Doing That's how I do most of my homework is through notes on my iPod science, etc. Okay, so we got mail there. I use mail. We got Safari, the internet browser, iTunes, of course, Adobe Photoshop CS4. I love to Photoshop things. Um, I've done quite a few. I've got a video. It's not on YouTube, but it is on Facebook, and uh, the reason it is not on YouTube is due to the fact of privacy. Um, I'm Photoshopping one of my friends, and I'm changing her hair color from blonde to black. Looks really, really good, and it's time-lapsed as well. Um, Final Cut Pro, I edit footage with this, I like to film things a lot. Um, I'll film concerts, that's why I created JP Films, um, is because I love to be behind the camera and operate it. Word, Microsoft Word, you know, everybody uses that. Skype, I am a Skype addict. Whenever I do my tutorials, I quit Skype just so I can um, focus more on the tutorial, but I am constantly on Skype. Even when it logs in, it says my name. Check this out. Hello, Jonathan. Welcome to Skype. I've said it to say my name, because I'm just that awesome. I'm going to quit Skype before people start talking to me. Okay, next thing, virtual DJ. I am a music addict. I absolutely love to create music. I've made a 25-minute mix that I just love. It's, it's wonderful. iPhoto, of course. I use it for all my photo, my photo collections. Um, yeah, iPhoto is iPhoto. Uh, Screenflow, obviously for making tutorials. iWeb for designing my website. Uh, Whitecap Standalone. This app's really, really cool. It'll, it um, uh, visualizes sound spoken. So check this out. Wait for it. Oh. Woo! Woo, 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 woo. And you can change it up. There's many different settings. Woo! It's, it's really, really fun. Um, and that's not just what it's for. You can also set the input source to any of these. These built-in ones are just... Um, they, they move the waves in a cool waveform. This can go full screen, too. Might as well do that. I'm a pixel freak. It has to be exact uh, screen resolution size. Okay. Whoa, that's pretty. Okay, I'll set that back to my microphone. Whoosh. Let's find a good one. Got presets in here. I love number two. Woo! Do you do that? Just really, really cool. Um, Twenty-six dollars from the company Sound. Sound Spectrum, and it works with iTunes. It's a visualizer in iTunes, so let's go ahead and play my newest favorite song from Frostwire, even though it's not. Passage D. Command T. Command F for full screen. I've set it to have that bar there. Presets change every so often. I'm, I'm manually changing these. Backgrounds change and so do the colors. The only reason it's really laggy right now is because I'm exporting three other tutorials. It's an absolutely stunning program. 
and there is actually a free version of it available from Sound. Oh, that makes me angry. Okay, okay. Um, yeah, Sound, SoundSpectrum.com, and uh, they've got four four programs, I believe: GeForce, Whitecap, Soft Skis, and Winter Wonders. I like Whitecap. You can download the free trial of it, which lasts forever. In the free trial, um, you don't get any of the intuitive on-screen menus, extensive library. You don't get the visual bar or the Whitecap standalone or the Whitecap screensaver you, or album artwork cover, one-year free updates, and the stand and the uh, support for multiple media players. But it works with iTunes, and it's free. I bought the $30 one, but here's a trick. If you buy the free trial and click the link through the free trial, um, it's only twenty six dollars. It lowers at five or twenty four dollars. Sorry, with tax it was twenty six, because um, I'm from Canada and it's U S. So there's that. It's absolutely amazing. I love it in every way. Um, hence why it's on my dock. Okay, next transmission. BitTorrent client. That's all I'll say. BitTorrent client. I download BitTorrents. Of course, the legal ones. And uh, QuickTime Broadcaster, you saw that in my prior tutorial, and System Preferences. Then I've created a stack of all my applications for quick and easy access. And uh, I've got my Dropbox documents, my documents, my downloads, and my files to go to my external. That's my doc, and I thank you for watching. Yeah, went quite well. Thank you. Bye.